Jaya! <laughs> uh, I don't know what she's laughing at. She just drank the rest of the juice. Well, <laughs> the topic for this video is how to date a wild tigress. Mm. We're lucky enough today in our temple to have a, a living form of a wild tigress. Look at this oh. goddess. Oh, welcome to my temple. <laughs> No, I think, you know, it's a little bit of a joke video, but um, no, it's real. It's like the, the wild woman. When men, when men are exposed to wild women, they go like, fuck, I'm not equipped to deal with that. I don't yeah, know how seriously. to deal with that. It's like wild means, you know, wild. It means uh, erotic. It means explosive. It means impulsive. It means changing directions all the time. It means, um, you know, unpredictable. It means, you know, energetically fiery. It's like there is... It's like dating a storm. Everything or a hurricane. is possible. Or... Everything and everything is possible. Yeah. Yeah. So how to date a wild woman is like how to date a, a hurricane. You know? <laughs> Sometimes. No, it's not that extreme. This woman here that I really deeply adore has has so much kindness and love and gentleness and lots of fire and impulsiveness. So there is a wide, wide range of possibilities. Every time I go like you know, we have a date on Saturday, you show up here at my temple. I never know what's going to happen. It's always like, oh, today we are going to be some doing some soft nurturing massage or go to the river or do something really that is in the harmony line. Then she shows up with a completely different mood that just blasts my plan out of the window and forces me into being in a totally different, different space. Yes. And um, sometimes it's the other way around. Sometimes I'm expecting something that is going to be fiery, explosive, trigger, challenging, and then she comes up with a deep sweetness and and so yeah you become a kitten <laughs> you become a ticker ticker kitten Ticken. Ticken. instead of a tigress no so there is all these flavors and um, you know what i like about it is that as a guy it really forces me into this this sense of being playful with energies and adaptability yes. it's like it's so yeah. magical because yeah. instead of being something that is predictable and rational that the male mind can comprehend is like from point a to point b you know it's like there is a straight line no it's like it's gonna go all over the place yeah, the, it's the interesting amount. yeah it's totally interesting it's well interesting. it's full it's like it's like full of every energy that there could be there's you know so it's an alive experience yeah. it's fully alive fully and um alive. if you are a, a man you know the topic for this video is how to date a wild tigress what i encourage you to do is to be okay you are okay with whatever she brings up into your field instead of you trying to be yeah. domesticating her or educating her do you want do you are you sure you want to domesticate a tiger it's like how does a domesticated tiger look like you know, behaving in straight ways in the circus. Boring. You know, it's boring. You want the tiger to stay wild. Yes. So if you if you meet a woman who is wild and, and like a tigress, what you want is to make sure that you keep her wild, mm -hmm. that you encourage her to be wild, yes. that whatever she brings into the field, you will be like, you know what, I'm okay with this. Just fucking blast me if you want to. <laughs> I can be wild, be real. Yeah. <laughs> And, um, and uh, me as a guy, mm. this is a gift. It's mm. being bombarded by the juiciness of all the flavors of the divine feminine that, that this woman expresses. <laughs> and so, you wow. know, it took me a while to figure it out. It was the first, um, I would say the first two, three months, the, the desire to, to change you or lock you into different frames and be like, you know, uh, when you do this, this is not okay. You're not supposed to be doing this. I go like, now it's a complete embracement. Like my, my um, being has become so spacious in terms of embracing the full dimension yes. of who you are that uh, I'm, I have the feeling that I can navigate the different, different flavors of of uh, your your energy and your expression from a place of really being okay i'm not you know right. the first the first time that we had a really strong energetic you know challenge i remember it took me like two weeks to recover i was like in the state of fuck wow that really hurts or that and now it's like a couple of minutes it's yes. like we can go into full rage and energy mode and then and then go back to normal like as if mm. nothing happened and so the your energy body, your, your your chakras, your whole system develops an ability to, to, to play, to navigate a little bit like a, like an energetic or emotional ninja. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's so beautiful. Um, a couple of things I wanted to say about that. 
Well, first, how good as a woman it feels to have a man show up and be like, yeah, bring it on. Bring it on. Like, show me. Mm -hmm. Show me it all. I'm up for it. And I can feel, and we've talked about it many times, that it's almost like there's a, it's kind of a meditation practice in a sense, because um, un, I'm not intentionally doing this, but my system and all its different energies that, it, that come forward in our relationship, they're asking you, Shiva, to, it's like, can you be okay here too? Mm, can you lovely. find your power here too? Can you be unshakable here too? Mm. In all the extreme flavors and colors, can you be present and still and connected here too? Mm. And it's like, yeah, it's an it's ultimate meditation, spiritual practice. Yeah, a beautiful journey. Personally, I mean, I'm so grateful uh, for women like you coming into my life. You know, mm. I had I had lovers before who, who brought those qualities, but right now it's with you that this juice is happening and i'm like every day i wake up and there is you know new flavors new energies yeah. coming up and lots of it is pure beauty pure bliss pure harmony and then fire kicking in so it's like it's it's just amazing it's, it's a wild a, like ride. yeah it's a yeah. wild ride i love it so yummy i want more yes <laughs> thank you bye